Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Keep Learning. Today we are going to learn the experiment of use of IP config command. You will find all practice file from the description. What is the objective of this experiment? Here we are going to do the practice of solving the problem which is a very much important for any networking examination. You will be given some task, you will be given some scenario and you need to solve the problem from the scenario. So in this experiment we are going to find out the problem in one local network then we will try to solve that problem and here to do this activity we will use the IP config command. So let us start. This is a lab scenario where computer 1, computer 2, 3 and 4 are connected to the wireless router and wireless router is connected with the internet. So we are going to check the configuration of all this computer. We are going to compare it and if there is any problem we are going to solve it. So now let us start the experiment. You will find these three files from the description. This is the practice file. Let us open it. Double click on the Cisco Packet Tracer file. You need a Cisco Packet Tracer software to open it. Here you will find two window. This window is the instruction window where you will get detail how to perform the experiment. This is a lab setup file where we are going to do the experiment. Let us split the window. I will use this word file to explain you the lab scenario. So now here in this network we need to find out the problem. So in any network how can you find out the problem? You can check the IP address, you can check the gateway, you can check the subnet mask, you can check the DNS server detail of this computer. If all are same then there is a no problem but if there is any difference then there might be a problem. So in same network let us check the connectivity. So here as per the instruction you can check the connectivity by doing a ping to www.cisco.pka web server. So let us ping from first computer. I will go to the desktop then command prompt then I will write down that uh, ping www.cisco.pka let me try with the another computer also then I will check the answer for all the computer cisco.pka let me do ping from the third computer so I am getting reply in third computer let me check for the fourth computer so here I am getting reply from fourth computer third computer second computer it is still waiting and from the first computer I am getting the so here we can easily find that these four computer are able to ping the Cisco website that means they are working there is no problem but in computer number two we are having some problem I am not getting any reply from computer number two so here I get the notification like ping request could not find host www.cisco.pk please check the name and try again so there might be some problem so how to identify problem let us learn it so what we will do I will check the IP address, subnet mask, gateway, DNS detail of this computer, computer 1, 3 and 4 which are successfully working. So I will check the detail for this computer and then I will compare the same detail with the computer number 2. It must be same. If there is any problem then I will change it and then I will again try to ping the website. So here let me uh, make the small size of this CLI font. So I can go to the option. I can go to the preferences. In preferences you will find the font. Let me make it 10. So I can show you all the computer. Okay. So now I will use the command ipconfig slash all. That is to verify configuration of computer. So I will go to the computer 1. I will go to the command prompt. I will write the command ip config slash all then I will go to the another computer I will write the same command computer number 3 go to the command prompt computer number 4 go to the command prompt now let us compare the detail of this computer computer number 4 computer number 3 computer number 2 where I have the problem 
so here you can check the detail of all the computer you should check the ip configuration subnet mask default gateway and dns server for this computer for computer number 3 for computer number 2 where i am getting the problem so let us check the detail of the computer number 2 with the other computer so first of all ip address which is 192.168.10.102 here it is 192.168.1.104 192.168.1.103 and 192.168.1.101 so here is the problem you can see that the network is changed in all the other three computer the network is 192.168.1. the detail and then here it is 192.168.10 so here it must be 1.102 so i will change this ip address and then i will again try to ping but let us check all other detail here the subnet subnet mask is 255 here same the subnet mask is 255 255 and it is same for all the computer then i will check the default gateway 192.168.1.1 it is same for all the computer and i will also check the dns server which is 192.15.2.5 192.15.2.5 192.15.2.5 and here 192.15.2.5 so here there is only one problem that means there is a problem in the network ip address so i will keep from 102 to 1 so let us go to the computer 2 in computer 2 just close this command prompt go to the ip configuration and change the network here from 10102 to 1.102 so now i have changed the ip address close it again go to the command prompt and try to ping the website www.cisco.pka so i am getting the reply so this is how i can solve the issue so this is how i have completed this activity i can check the result from this tab so here uh, congratulations on completing this acti activity this is how you can do the practice for the examination thank you solve it hope you like my video if you have any question any doubt please write down in the comment we will meet in the next tutorial thank you bye bye